designers settled on an attractive blend of angles and a smoothly swooped tank to define the overall look of the FJ09. A large flange atop the tank looks like a good spot to hang one's knee in a really deep turn, but they look to be a bit too far from the rested leg position to actually be used as such. The front fairing is rather minimal, mainly just a headlight housing and windshield mount, and by itself is unlikely to shield the rider from much in the way of weather. Most of the protection comes from the windshield itself. One detail I am glad to see is the vented windshield arrangement that allows some air to bleed beneath the glass to relieve the pocket of low pressure that forms when underway. Some of my most miserable riding experiences were on my old FXRP, where the fairing and tall windshield work together to deprive my full face helmet of enough air to vent properly, leading to hopelessly fogged up visor and sweat drenched hair. A vented windshield combats this adverse effect and provides a much more comfortable ride, which is arguably the most important attribute for a commuter bike.